It's 519 public school, private school, even boarding school and more parents in the upstate can learn about education options for their children in one place. 7 News' Christine Scarpelli is live at the Hyatt Regency in Greenville ahead of today's upstate education all. preview. Hi, Christine. Red, we've got it all. Do not let the rain deter you when you come over to the Hyatt right in downtown Greenville, 4 to 7 a.m. I mean, sorry, p.m. <laughs> because it's 4 a.m. now, David. Mm, I'm here with David. He is from St. John Academy. It's not, it's not Johnsbury St. Academy. Johnsbury, it's not yeah. close. No, it's not close. In Vermont. Yeah, this we're is really Vermont. exciting. I'm excited to Thanks be here. Thanks for coming all the way down here. I say that and I start out with where you're from in Vermont because this really, these schools are from all over the place and they all offer different things. Many of them concentrated class sizes uh, to really grow, I think, a lot of students. Absolutely. And again, some of them aren't right here at home, so I think that provides, provides a whole new experience. Tell me a little bit about St. Johnsbury Academy. Yeah. Tell me like why you decided to go there, an alum we have. Sure. Um, so I'm happy, happy to do that. St. Johnsbury Academy, we founded in 1842. Um, so we've been around for a really long time. Wow. And we've been an international boarding school for over 130 of those years. International. International boarding school. We have kids representing over 25 countries every year. Um, so, you know, one of the things that I think is really special about our school is that not only can you come and get a really high level college preparatory education, we have 31 advanced placement courses, uh, a, a really fantastic STEM program, a world class fine and performing arts program, but we also are one of the only boarding schools, if not the only boarding school in the country, that has a full career in tech ed center right on our campus built into our college prep program. Tech education, guys, that sounds familiar for around here. We've got a lot of jobs that feature tech in the yeah. engineering sector. We're going to have much more this morning on schools from all over. Boy, it sounds like the country, which yeah. is so exciting, David. To learn more about your school in particular, is tonight a good place to come? Tonight's a great place. Come and stop by our table, learn all about every everything that we have to offer. Um, you know, one of the things, another thing that's really important about our school is our, even though we're a bigger school, we have about a thousand students, um, our class sizes are super small mm. and we have a lot of learning support for kids that might need it. So if there's a student out there who maybe is just not uh, performing at their optimal level in their public school or, or the private school, right. um, come see us and we can see if we can help you out. Listen guys, plenty of help from across the country tonight from four to seven here at the Hyatt. Back to you. All right, they're in one place. Thank you, Christine. Next on 7 News, the federal government.